Good morning, Pastors. I can't believe it. We're almost done with our first week in 2021. I'm so excited because this morning I am here with Mrs. McDonough for our Thinking Thursday. Now I pass the mic to Mrs. McDonough. So it's going to be a great day, Thursday, January 7th, 2021. And today we are going to start with the pledge. If you could please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. So let's take a moment to recite our bucket filler pledge. We pledge to do our best to be bucket fillers each day by being kind to others and watching what we say. If we accidentally spill the bucket of a friend, we'll say we're sorry and be kind until their bucket is full again. And really remember, being a bucket filler not only fills someone else's bucket, but it does fill your own because you can feel really good about yourself when you're being kind to others. So on Thinking Thursday, I really want you to think about what are you curious about that happens in the world around us? What do I want to learn more about? And it, when you're thinking about that, once you decide, we have lots and lots of books that are nonfiction about real things. So I want to think, do I want to learn more about space? Maybe about wicked weather? Maybe what ants do? Maybe I want to talk about, you know, the force and motion in different types of games that we play with balls. Maybe I want to learn more about being in the kitchen and cooking and how we put foods together. Maybe just about rice across the world. Lots of people eat rice that connects us. Maybe I want to learn about birds or the world of plants. So we have lots and lots of books on nonfiction that can help us learn about the things we're curious about. What are you curious about? What do you want to read more about? If you see me in the hallway and you want to share what you're curious about, I'm going to help you find a book on that topic and we'll let you take that book home and keep it. Look forward to talking to you about what you're curious about. Now, we've got some things coming up. Starting this Friday, if you want to run for student council next year, the 21-22 school year, please see Mrs. Keating for the paperwork. And you know what? We have another opportunity for a fun day here at Franke Park on January 15th, a week from this Friday. You can wear a hat. Just bring some change that you find at home, bring it in, and when you come through the school in the morning, We'll drop the change and you can wear a hat. Any amount of change, a few pennies, quarters, and this is more money that's going to go toward Riley Hospital. So have a great thinking Thursday. Look forward to seeing you around. Foxes, just a reminder to always be a wise owl. And when you're reading books, always think about how the wise owl works with our amygdala, our barking dog, because emotions can also be positive. So bucket filling is a positive emotion because you're expressing love and kindness toward others. Mrs. McDonough, thank you for that. And Foxes, remember, make a great day or not. The choice is yours. <laughs>